Hi everyone. I have a small Sephora haul for you today and um, yeah, so I'll get started. First off, I already talked about this in a previous video. I wanted to pick up the Burlesque palette from Buxom. This is what it, the container looks like. Um, it's got a magnetic closure. It's kind of cute. So the colors are a light pink, a sparkling black, a brighter pink, gray, and a, a matte light gray. So I used it today. This is what it looks like. Um, yeah, I like it. I think that I will get a lot of use out of it. I think that um, between this and the, excuse me, the Belly Dance palette, uh, I'm already thinking about the Tango palette. I really love them. Um, this one I would say is my favorite. It's just a little bit more interesting. It's got a little more depth. These are really pretty though and I think they're all really well pigmented. So I recommend these. Um, if you're in the market for a new palette, these have a good range and they have um, really good texture. It's very smooth and easy to work with. So those were fun. Um, the other thing I had ordered was I, I'm really a big fan of the Kors Lip Butter in Jasmine, so here's another one of those. But I bought that as part of a set with something called Cheek Butter. So it's a blush. Um, I'm not a huge cream blush user, but look at the pigmentation on that. It's really good. So I'm thinking underneath, um, underneath, <laughs> yes, to use underneath a powder blush. This might be a nice product. I really like this brand. I like that it's all paraben free and it's natural. So hopefully it'll be a great a great buy. This was twenty five dollars for the set. These alone I think are twelve dollars. So it was you know hopefully it'd be worth it. And then the other thing I ordered that I was really excited about was um, because I had ordered this summer vanilla deodorant from La Vanilla, and it smells. It reminds me a lot of Clinique Simply, which I pulled out. I ordered this from eBay. This was discontinued several years ago, and on a whim, I was like, ooh, I really miss that smell. I think it was when I was pregnant. I was kind of like craving the smell, and I still love it. I wish they'd bring it back. I don't know why they discontinued things, but I guess maybe it just didn't sell well. So this reminded me a lot of Clinique Simply, and I thought, ooh, I'm gonna order that perfume. Hopefully it be a lot like Clinique Simply. And I have been ordering roller balls just for the convenience factor and then, you know, to see if I really like the perfume. But, yep, pretty much smells nothing like Clinique Simply, but the deodorant does. So, oh, you got me. Oh, excuse me, I'm all out of breath. But this is nice. This is really coconut and, like, pineapple. Um, it's nice. It's not overly cloying and phony smelling. It's nice. I'll use it. I'll keep it in my purse, but it's not simply. They simply should bring this back. How cliche was that? So that's my little haul. Um, like I said, I did use the palette today and yeah, I like it. I, I'm, I'm really enjoying those. I think that that's a great product and I eventually probably will own all of them, but you know, that's embarrassing to admit. <laughs> What can you do? I hope you're having a great day and I will talk to you soon. Take care.